What's going on guys? In today's video, I wanna give you my thoughts on squishing the bug. Squishing the bug is something that's taught to kids when they first get into baseball. But as we get a little bit older, more advanced, and more aware of our body, we actually wanna get away from squishing the bug. We're gonna get into that right now. So first off, let's talk about what squishing the bug is. Okay, when a player swings, they're taught at a young age that when they swing, as they turn, they wanna squish a bug with their back foot like that. Now the reason it's taught that way is because it gets kids to engage their hips. Because when they're younger, usually they just kinda swing with their arms like that. Okay, but when you tell them to squish the bug, it forces them to turn their hips and start to use their lower half. Because if they squish the bug and their shoelaces and hips are facing the pitcher, then that means they're using their hips. Okay, if not, if they're just like this, that means they're just using their, all their arms. Now, I like teaching the younger kids squish the bug because it does get them to engage their hips. But as you get a little bit older and a little bit stronger, we're gonna get away from that. So the more advanced version or what's actually happening when we swing is we're in a load stride to launch position. Once we get to launch position, we start our swing. Back knee's gonna drive under the hip, hips gonna turn, heels gonna come forward. Okay, as opposed to turning it backwards our heel's gonna come forward. Okay, you see the difference between that, squishing the bug, and then coming forward. Okay, so launch position, knee, hip, heel, to swing, and finish. Now, if you pause any MLB player at contact, you're gonna see that their back foot is actually moving forward, and it's off the ground at contact. So a simple drill to get the kids who are squishing the bug to get away from squishing the bug is we're gonna put a bucket right at their heel. You can use a bucket, a block, or a cone, or whatever you want. And we're just gonna load to launch position, and we're just gonna do a slow motion swing. Okay, hips gonna turn, knees gonna come under the hip, heels gonna go forward, and then we're gonna swing. Okay, nice and slow. Do a couple slow motion swings. Okay, and then they can do a full swing. Okay. If they do squish the bug, they're gonna hit this bucket. They're just gonna turn, their heel's gonna go backwards, they're gonna slide the bucket or they're just gonna stop. Okay, but if they're doing it correctly, then their heel's gonna come forward and then they're gonna swing. And another drill that's gonna help this is the swing sequence PVC drill. Okay, so we're gonna put the PVC pipe over our head like this, and we're gonna get into launch position. Okay, we're gonna keep our upper half stationary, this pipe's not gonna move. We're gonna turn this back hip, drive this back knee under the hip, making sure that that heel comes forward. Okay, reset, knee, hip, heel, reset, and then same thing, and then we're gonna swing. Okay, really avoid having that heel go backwards. We want it to go forwards. Do you see the difference between backwards and forwards? That's what we wanna do. So I'm okay with beginners being taught squish the bug, but as you get older and you wanna be an elite hitter, you actually wanna do what I showed you in this video. Thank you so much for watching guys. If you liked the video, please give it a thumbs up. And if you haven't yet, hit that subscribe button below and I'll see you next week.